Hello, this is Hans from HG Web Design. This is about uh, Drupal security. A little video. Uh, uh, in the weekly drop from Drupal, I read this blog by Darren Motterzele. I hope I pronounced it right. And one is in one of uh, his uh, uh, tips was to turn off access to user one, the super user admin user who can do any anything is never required on a production site and i agree with that so how do you do this well i prepared a site this is a very uh, a fresh drupal 7 installation uh, okay i want to log out to s let you see that this all works admin and admin and login. Okay, no problem. But now I want to uh, uh, make it impossible to log in as an admin, a super user one. Okay, how do we going to do this? Well, I installed a fresh uh, Drupal site. And with this Drupal site becomes a data uh, b uh, is a database, so as you know. And on this database, I called it uh, Drupal Seven Test DB. You have users, and when you click on that, then you get. I have to remove this a little bit. Okay. Then here you see I had uh, I have two users. One is admin and one is uh, an authenticated user okay this user when i click on uh, change you get this database table and the important thing here is to uh, change this zero as active of uh, this one as active to zero not active Okay, then you click start. Then we can check if everything worked. Let's see. Yes, the status is now zero. And now let's see if uh, I log out. Access denied. Okay, that's already. Okay. Now we go to admin and admin again. Try to log in. Username is not being activated or blocked, and that is not being activated is correct. Okay. I told you I had other user. Let's see if that still works. Yep, it still works. Uh, it's very barely, but uh, you can see I can log out here, so that means that I'm logged in. So, okay, let's see if. Uh, but if you have uh, the uh, the need to uh, do something on your site, on your production site, then it's very easy. You go back to PHP My Admin or your database to Users, then you click on it and choose Change. Go back here, change zero to one. Click start, check if your admin settings are being stored. Yes, that's the case. Okay, then we go back and now let's see. Try to refresh the page. Let's see admin and admin again. Login and voila, you're back. So, if you want to block a super user on your production site, go to your database, choose choose uh, choose choose users. Mm -hmm, my English. And then go to admin and change, and set the status to zero or one, whatever you want. And then you can't uh, reach your site from the web 
a super user. Yeah. Okay. I hope for I hope that was helpful. Uh, greetings. Bye.